Well, again, that's what we're being told. We haven't actually seen anything. So we're being told that there are a few of her tests, of which again, everybody already understands that the Moscow lab was doing this. Um, that apparently without her doing, and without her being one of the protected athletes, which she was not, to make clear, um, they still, but despite that, decided to go in. And again, we're being told without being shown evidence that her bottles through some sort of forensic analysis show that they also were, were scratched and perhaps opened. Well, I mean, we were initially told on August 6th, we, we, stand, we believe the IWF should stand by their 9th of July decision, which said that none of the testing in Russia was reliable, and the reason why she was approved was because she was tested 87% of the time outside of Russia. That hasn't changed. She was still tested 87% of the time outside of Russia, and that, that's still, the, nothing changed in the last four weeks. She plans to say the truth, which is that she's a clean athlete and she had, she's lived outside of Russia for most of the last three years. And uh, certainly throughout the period that they considered, which was January 1 of 2014 to the present. And, uh, and beyond that, she really can't control what happened.